Hello and welcome in Dying Light once again. Today, I just want to talk about the new stuff. I did stream yesterday. And, yeah, I, I just had to sleep about stuff that's been changed. And, uh, but let's talk about Halloween first. Halloween f uh, event is quite nice. I like it. It's a good step in the right direction. But it's not enough. I mean, okay, there is a personal goal to collect 3,000 treats. Easy, right? We're halfway. We're halfway of collecting global. That's how much people have been playing it. Or it's really, really low. For two weeks, this goal is super low. Well, previous goal, we didn't make it the bounties for Vampire the Masquerade. That's why, remember to visit Techland GG site and claim uh, those those items, Paraglider and the Charm, you can buy for seven tokens, thingies, that you collect on a site. Get yourself it, because this Charm is, is actually nice. It it buffs, uh, yeah. Weapon mod charge uh, effectiveness increased by 20%. It's really, really nice. So, event. Today I'm primarily talking about event, and I complained previously that there is just no intensive incentive to do anything. Nothing, because, yeah, I do my personal goal and I can fuck off, because there is nothing else I can do, because it's boring. Baka, <laughs> zombies, is selling loads of shit. Uh, loads is uh, maybe a little bit too much, but you level up with him, and you buy stuff. That's great, right? Yes, it is. However, I'm on level 10, and I bought multiple these, multiple these, and Global give us Nightmare Claw recipe, a uh, blueprint. But I would love if Techland, well, Techland, if you listen in, please. I would love if they add more. Give me a reason to play this fucking game for 14 days, because even the last 14 days, and get level back, I don't know, 30. So he sells something unique, prestigious, something, something really good. That's how you make people play your game. It's MMO treatment, treatment but that's how you play. You give us those rewards that we have, something later in the track, more expensive, and something super fucking expensive, super, super, you know, prestigious, that you really need to put dedication in order to get it. Not everyone gonna get it? Okay, fine. Maybe next year we're gonna get it. That's perfect. That would work perfectly, because we would have a goal. We would have a reason to play. Hey, I'm grinding Baka because I want to have, I don't know, fucking mount. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's MMO treatment, like I said. But yeah, give me something like unique skin, weapon skin, uh, unique weapon. Uh, they're adding new stuff. Since they're adding gun, why wouldn't you like let us have a gun right away? Like a pistol, regular pistol that looks like a pumpkin or something. I don't know. The barrel roll with the, the I mean the barrel with the bullets like look, look like a pumpkin. I don't know, it's so easy to fucking design anything. Since you're adding weapons very soon, you could give us unique a gun. I hate that paraglider skins, because I never saw my paraglider. That's the fucking thing. I never saw it. Never. Because I never look up when I'm paragliding. I'm looking forward. So give me 
something else. Jesus, I don't know. There's so many ideas I throw on a site and they weren't registered. Like a room. Let us have a room in, in Fish Eye so we can like do something with it. And let us buy stuff for events so we can, you know, put it like pumpkin head on a fucking table or something. I don't know. Just something or give us, I don't know, paint so we can paint, I don't know, fish eye or whatever, like a wall, graffiti, anything better than paraglider skin. Or let us develop a settlement, just something. Add traps, like, let us, give us like, I don't know, scrap of a map. Or give us, give us anything, like, fuck. Give me the, this and set up our base and we can develop, rebuild, build it up, like set up some barricades, UV lights, stuff like this. And vendors like Baka would play an extra role because let's say they, they sell some extra decorations. I know it's, it's wishful thinking, I know. It's a good, it's it's a step in the right direction because compared to previous events, this this is something, right? But I I actually had everything last night and I was like level six because I was yeah level six yeah level six. All I need to have is level six to unlock everything. Way too soon, way too soon. Venom Sting blueprint should not be level 5, should be level 10, 15, in order to make our time, like, more interesting, because even started yesterday, it lasts, like, 12 hours, and I'm done. I don't have to worry about global, because it's for sure done, and I have everything. So I can spend all those things on collecting stuff that I'm gonna stockpile in my bag God knows what for because I'm hoping I'm gonna use ever use that which probably not going to happen so there is so many things Teclan can still develop I know they're working on on upcoming stuff but previous previous uh, event was so terrible, it was boring, and it was nothing interesting, it was... I need to have a reason to be hooked in this game, and I'm, like, if you want to extend gameplay and, like, you know, people playing, we need more. And more, not just skins, new weapons that they add, the scythe is brilliant i love it sadly you need to <laughs> you really need to have gear for it new exotic uh, quality of weapons great there is good stuff i like new skins i like everything i'm not buying anything because why in the end it, it's single single player game that is quite quite boring if you've done everything okay so, my Harper level, I don't know, it's like 100 something, yeah, 144, Shen Yu is 136, and I'm done with them as well, because they should have something, like on level 100, something interesting, I... Back me up, back me up here, because, yeah, I want to play this game more and more. I want to be hooked in it for a long-ass time. But I just don't have a reason. Those bounties are super fast. I think they trying to make bounties easy, so everyone can hop up and, and collect it before times run out. Yeah, no luck with exotic weapons. Not at all. Yeah, I wonder why do I collect all this shit? Not gonna lie. 
it's it's too much of everything. But yeah, give us reason. Event is good. I like it. It 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 hooked me for more than an hour. But I I swear to God, we need we need much more in order to this game to be alive. I know it's not MMO. I know, but I'm pretty sure they. The Techland would love to have a life service out of it. Just a little bit. So in order to be a life service, we need to have something to do. More than we do now. I mean, repeatable uh, GRE anomalies. They give shit loads of experience. Shit loads of experience. Like six grand. And a crate that can contain exotic weapon, right? But how long Techland thinks people are gonna farm it? I mean, some some will probably a lot. But we had a prison in Dying Light One. Boss Accord, uh, yeah, challenges, Hell Raid, a lot of other stuff. We don't have anything here. Like the bloody arena. Oh my god, it's so fucking. Ah, uh, no, no, no. The arena, I got... Honestly, I didn't finish story yet. I know I should, and I'm probably gonna do, because that's the way to extend my gameplay here, because nothing else I can do to be meaningful. But... Man, I just look at stuff, and... Let me manage a shithole to defend... A ta give us task to NPCs like the people like hey Harvard make it like we need to collect take care of people I know it's make it a mini game even a mini game something different interface like you did with Hell Raid right so make it like a strategy or something like the the smartphone game where you need to harvest stuff and you need to take care of your people just I'm throwing weird ideas now I know and we got some goodies like hey the renegades drop weapons they use great but if you play long enough you have that much money that much of resources shitloads of everything so why would I care it's good for new players and granted it should be like that. I still have items for almost a million to sell. Ugh. Those red crystals, that was a long time ago. I still have them. I just don't see a point of even doing anything. I mean, slashing zombies, it's great. But for how long? So question is, what next? Can we have something... Interesting. What else? Okay, so now you can dismantle here. You don't have to change difficulty now, let's say, and sell it. You can just get some value out of it. Usually it's nothing, nothing amazing, not gonna lie. I mean, feathers, oh yeah. If there's a way to, to farm feathers like this, I'll take it, because... Fuck me, I hate farming feathers. No, nothing, ooh. So yeah, this is definitely great. This is... Life, like quality life improvement, amazing, amazing. Volatiles, I mean, now you can be beat up a little bit faster, so I assume the nightmare gonna be unforgiving, which is okay. Okay, what next? Uh, oh, more treats, yay. See, that's the point. No excitement of receiving anything. There is a new plague outfit for free if you claim it now. 
they added some new stuff and I used my three dying light points for Scarecrow outfit and a scythe because I like it. Also, I have a paraglider which I'm never gonna see, ever. I, I doubt it. Uh, you can buy Dying Laugh bat in on a Dying Light uh, Teclan GG. But it's bugged at the moment. And once you claim it, it will disappear. Uh -huh. it's, it's almost always like that. I swear to God, it's just another event where situation repeats itself. Yeah, the, the exotic weapons have higher damage. My scythe, which is legendary, does a thousand damage plus now. So you can have it. Uh, yeah, I'm collecting these like I think they're gonna be useful in any way of shape. Got the eggs, dynamite, guns. I just collect stuff, but Look at this. I'm collect I and I don't even have the bloody ties shit yet in my stash. I'm gonna have to have to browse through it like crazy and for nothing. It feels useless. It feels useless. Add weird resources like I don't know, wood, other stuff, what even water, and just let us take care of other, others and some settlements and stuff like this. There's a couple more things that they added. It's definitely worth to play now. It's, it's fun. It's fun, but if you have time, as I do, you're gonna... You're gonna smash this 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 content in less than twelve hours, and and then you're gonna feel empty because okay, I did everything, I got stuff from Baka. You can continuously grind it, XP points go crazy. You can also buy yourself an experience. That's that's a new stuff. You can buy yourself exp uh, legend points with your uh, infected trophies. And even the military tech, so it's not useless in your bag if you have everything maxed out. Or mutation samples. You can spend mutation samples on uh, on just getting max level out. But in my mind, level points are the only last thing I have to do in this game. So I... That's the reason I'm not grinding them. So I, I, I have a reason to play this game even because, hey, I'm going to get some levels. Cool. That that gives me a reason to play it. But I'm running out of them. If you want to replace Charm, you have to... Yeah, you have to demolish, dismantle previous one. So it's important to know. Korak now is giving multiplier damage when weapon durability is low. It's also a good info to know. I'm thinking, is there anything else? I don't think so. I, I mean, there is plenty of things and you should definitely try it out because, yeah, the game is fun. Uh, apparently, they did some changes with the... Uh, Darkness in uh, Darker Nights uh, grading, but saturation saturation is just oh look at this unnatural fire it's just I I just hate it I like the darkness itself but and but during the day I hate the color so I'm switching to Haran Sunset and I forget to switch at night looks looks dope looks really really nice well it burns my eyes a little bit there are other things more detailed you can go it's advanced settings where you can do a lot of stuff i'm not touching that yet because uh because i don't need it at the moment i'm i'm most likely gonna do it 
I don't mind lens flare because <laughs> I'm a photographer. Uh, like maybe glow would, yeah, whatever. Uh, I don't mind. I, I'm not like graphic snob where I, I really need to have everything pimp it out. But yeah, it's a really improvement compared to previous events. It's really, that should be a standard to, to do more than just, you know, personal goal and fuck off. We need more, much, much more. So please, Techland, keep it up. Don't give up. Give us more. And we're gonna play the we go we're gonna play this game. We just need to have a reason. So Timon, please listen. Proszę. Posłuchaj. I'm saying in Polish to Timon. Please give us reason to play. And yeah, it's gonna be great. But without it, it's just single player game. Anyway, that's it from me today. Let me know what do you think. Do you like it? I hope you do. What would you want more from Techland? What would you add? Let's gather ideas and we can make a, you know, a massive post on reddit or just sign those ideas in on the techland side and anything just let's they're listen so let's use that let's use that and improve our beloved game because i do want to kill zombies forever Thank you for watching. Hope to see you next time. Take care and bye bye.